गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स लास्ट लेक्चर वी हैव टू डिस्कस एंड द इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ द इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ आयोनिक कंडक्टिविटी इन आयोनिक कंडक्टिविटी इन सॉलिड्स ओके दिस पॉइंट वी हैव टू डिस्कस इन द लास्ट लेक्चर वी हैव टू डिस्कस द स्केमेटिक रिप्रेजेंटेशन ऑफ द वैकेंसी मैकेनिज्म एंड द इंटरेस्ट रिटर्न मैकेनिज्म एंड एंड ऑल्सो वी हैव टू डिस्कस अबाउट द डायग्राम of the schematic representation of the energy and the diagram of the schematic uh, representation of the sodium chloride type of structures okay and this all about we have to discuss in last lecture okay then the definition of the activation energy is about the energy required okay look at this definition that definition shows that the energy required to make the uh, make the jump ओके द एनर्जी रिक्वायर टू मेक दी जम नोन एज एक्टिवेशन एनर्जी मीन्स द एक्टिवेशन एनर्जी इट इज रिक्वायर टू मेक दी जम्स इट इज नोन एज एक्टिवेशन एनर्जी ओके एक्टिवेशन एनर्जी मीन्स वॉट की एनर्जी रिक्वायर टू मेक दी जम्स मीन्स दिस एनर्जी इट इज रिक्वायर दी जम एंड दिस एनर्जी इज नोन एज एक्टिवेशन एनर्जी ओके देन नेक्स्ट पॉइंट इज अबाउट द टेम्परेचर डिपेंडेंस of the mobility of the ions it can be expressed by an arrhenius equation okay the temperature means therefore the different types of the temperature we have to its mobility also increases okay therefore the temperature its dependence of the mobility means temperature its dependence of mobility of ions mobility of ions it can be expressed by an arrhenius equation means this mobility this mobility of the ion it is expressed by arrhenius equation okay this arrhenius equation is equal to mu micron is equal to micron is directly proportional uh, proportional to exponentials into bracket minus ea upon kt bracket is completed okay this is the arrhenius equation uh, for the mobility of ion expression okay then the uh, mu micron is equal to micron zero into exponential Uh, into bracket minus e upon k t bracket is completed where the micron zero is the proportionality constant micron zero is the proportionality constant okay the micron zero means it is a proportionality proportionality constant and it is known as free pre exponential factor means this pro, micron zero proportionality constant it is also known as pre exponential factor okay this pre exponential factor it is a depend on several factor the number of times per second that the ion atom the move v called as the atom frequency means therefore the micron zero it is also known as proportionality constant and this proportionality constant it is also known as pre exponential factor it is also known as pre exponential factors and this pre exponential factor it is a depend on several factor it is depend on several factor that the factor is the number of times per second that the factor is number of time per second the ion attempt to move v the ion attempt to move v it called atom frequency it called atom frequency and the distance moved by the ions the distance moved by the ion and the size of external field means your distance of the uh, atom frequency it is a move by the ion and the size of external field means your atom frequency size uh, size of external field and the distance and the ions distance it is a movable ion distance it is a movable means the distance moved by ions and the size of external field means therefore your distance is move there uh, this distance is move by ions and the size of external field it is a provided to the distance is move okay this is all about the uh, introductory part of this formula of the arrhenius equation okay then ionic conductivity with the temperature that has for that has for the sigma is equal to sigma 0 upon t into exponentials of into bracket minus ea upon t okay this term of this sigma 0 okay sigma 0 is now contained the n and z d n and z d okay n and z d as well as the information on the atom frequency and the jumps 
distances okay therefore this sigma zero okay look at this formula of the ionic conductivity temperature is about this sigma is equal to sigma zero upon t into exponential into bracket minus ea upon t bracket is completed therefore these terms of sigma zero okay the term of sigma zero terms of sigma zero it is now contained means sigma zero it is now contained n and xenon okay n and xeon that is a zd zd is zd is a atomic number uh, atomic uh, mass number or the e is electron okay therefore the sigma zero is now contained n and zd as well as the information and information on the atom frequency and the jumps distance means this n and zd it is a, it is a information as well as the information this information on the atom top frequency and jump distance means uh, nitro, uh, n small n and z is information on atom top frequency and jump distance it is showing the uh, n value and the z value okay then the ionic conductivity it is uh, increases with the temperature ionic conductivity it is uh, increases with the temperature means your ionic conductivity increases therefore your temperature it is also increases okay therefore the log of sigma t is equal to log of sigma zero plus uh, ea upon t okay this is the ionic conductivity increases with the temperature and this is the logarithm formula of the sigma t that is about the log of sigma t is equal to log of sigma zero plus minus uh, plus into bracket ea upon t okay this is the ionic conductivity increases with the temperature and its formula of uh, logarithm its formula is in logarithm that about the log of sigma t is equal to log of sigma zero plus into bracket ea upon t okay therefore the plotting log of sigma t against the one upon t it should produce the straight line with the slope of minus ea okay uh, therefore look at this uh, diagram okay uh, this is a plotting okay therefore the plotting in sigma t it is against 1 upon t it should produce a straight line with this slope of minus ca means in this ionic conductivity in solid therefore we have to draw the uh, graph of uh, log of sigma t against the 1 upon t and it should produce this straight line it should produce the straight line graph and with the slope of minus ea means its slope is minus ea ea means it is a activation energy okay the expression in the equation 5.20 it is sometime plotted the empirical formula is about the sigma is equal to sigma 0 into exponential into bracket minus ea upon t okay this is the uh, plotting of the empirical formula of the uh, of this equation 5.10 okay then the because the plotting either log of sigma t or the log of sigma makes the little difference to the slope and uh, both types of the plots means therefore we have to plot this uh, graph and this graph it is a plotting either in either in log of sigma t or the log of sigma means you have to this plotting in log of sigma t or the log of sigma makes the little difference to the slope makes the little difference to the slope both the types of plots means we have to replace this log of sigma t we have to plot the log of sigma okay log of sigma and the log of sigma t its difference is slope okay difference to little difference between the log of sigma t and the log of sigma okay and this is to the slope this is to the slope and the both the types of plot both the types of plotting okay therefore this is the diagram this is the diagram of conductivity of selected solid electrolysis over the range of temperature okay we have to introduction of this uh, graph such as the plots are straight line okay we have to taking the graph about the graph of the conductive uh, conductivity of the selective solid electrolytes over a range of temperature okay therefore the plot are straight line apart from the one of lithium iodide where we can clearly see the two lines of the differing slope okay look at this lithium iodide slope okay this lithium iodide uh, this slope it shows the two lines okay this shows the two lines and this two line it is a differing the differing the slope means one is a uh, upper side is a zero to 
minus 2 point uh, minus 3 something okay therefore it is a one line and then it is provided to the uh, another line it is a lithium iodide okay this is the two line differing the slope okay this two line is a differing the slope and this explanation for these two slopes in the plot lies in the fact that even the pure crystal of lithium iodide it contain the some purity means therefore the you have to take in the lithium iodide impurity okay sorry uh, you have to take in the lithium iodide uh, slope okay this slope uh, slopes in the plot of lies in the fact that even the very pure crystal of lithium iodide contains means these uh, slopes of the plot lines it gives the pure crystal very pure crystal of the lithium iodide contains some impurity okay of the lithium iodide contain some impurity and that line corresponding to low temperature of the extrinsic vacancy means this lies corresponding to low temperature at the extrinsic vacancy okay extrinsic vacancy means it is a vacant point okay therefore the low temperature low temperature the concentration of intrinsic vacancy is small okay you have to temperature is high the concentration of intrinsic vacancy is high therefore low temperature therefore the concentration of intrinsic vacancy is small okay that it can be ignored means your temperature is low therefore concentration of intrinsic vacancy is small therefore it can be ignored okay you have to ignore this concentration of intrinsic vacancy because it is a dominated by defect created by the impurity means uh, this temperature that is a low temperature as a concentration of the intrinsic vacancy and that is ignored why ignored because this is dominated by the defects means this is dominated by the defect the uh, defect is a uh, dominated and it is created the impurity means this concentration of intrinsic vacancy is small therefore this created the impurity impurity is created by the concentration of intrinsic vacancy is small okay for the particular amount of impurity the number of vacancy present will be essential constant and the number of amount of impurity okay therefore different types of the amount of impurity and this amount of impurity it is a consider the vacancy present essentially constant vacancy cast essentially constant therefore the temperature is given by temperature is given by therefore the microm is equal to microm 0 into exponential into bracket minus ea upon kt okay this is the temperature dependence formula that is a microm is equal to microm 0 into x exp that is the exponential into bracket minus ea upon kt bracket is completed okay then the next uh, diagram of the ionic conductivity of nacl plotted against the reciprocal of the temperature okay look at this diagram shows the higher temperature on the left hand side of the graph okay you have to take on the left side left hand side that is the tk okay therefore its uh, concentration of the intrinsic defect is increases concentration of intrinsic defect is increases and it is a extent that the now similar to greater than concentration of extrinsic defect okay this uh, this figure shows that you have to temperature is high on the left hand side the concentration of intrinsic defect is increases means left hand side you have to high the temperature therefore concentration of intrinsic defect is increases and the extent that now similar to greater than the concentration the extrinsic effect is greater means you have to uh, greater the uh, extrinsic concentration therefore your defect is increases okay this is the diagram of the ionic conductivity of nacl plotted against the reciprocal temperature okay then the ns ns you have also known about the uh, number of scotty defects formula okay this is uh, uh, this is uh, derivation this derivation we have to discuss in the concentration of the defects okay therefore look at this formula of the uh, number of scotty defect okay ns is equal to n exponential into bracket minus delta hs upon 2 kt okay this is the number of